Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now for today's video, I'm going to do a collaboration with Makeup by Dee Dee here on YouTube. I actually met her through Grapevine and we decided to do a colorful makeup look, especially because we're in the summertime and you could just play with color. And this is what I came up with. Now you're not going to see any neutrals, any browns, none of that. You're all going to see just colorful shadows. And even though it's, it's a lot of color, I do think it's still very wearable. Now, don't forget to check out Makeup by Dee Dee's video. I'll be sure to link it down below and subscribe to her. She's beautiful, she's talented, and I know you're going to love her. And also, don't forget to subscribe to me so you can check out all my videos. And so if you want to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. So my eyes are already primed with the Urban Decay Primer Potion and the MAC Pangelate Paint Pot. The one that I'm using is called Art in the Streets by Wet n Wild. I'm going to take the orange color with my Sigma E25 blending brush and put it all over my crease and blend it upwards. This is going to be my transition color. Next I'm going to take the purple shade and I'm going to take my Sigma E55 eyeshading brush. I'm going to put this all over my lid. I'm going to tap it. I'm just going to keep on adding until I'm satisfied. Now all I'm doing is going back with the Sigma E25 brush and just blending it all out. With this look, it's important to blend, blend, blend. Next I'm taking the green shade from the same palette and I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Duo brush with the pencil side. I'm going to pack this on the outer corner of my eye and just drag it up a little bit towards the middle of my crease. Now I'm blending everything out with a clean Sigma E25 blending brush. With this color I'm just going to keep on adding products and then blending. Adding products and blending until I'm satisfied with the color. I'm just blending everything out with my Sigma E25 brush with, with a little bit of the orange shadow. I'm just adding a little bit more of the purple to make it more opaque. And of course, I'm blending it all out. Now I'm taking the yellow shade with my Urban Decay Naked 3 brush and just putting it in the inner corner of my eyes and on the brow bone. again I'm blending it all out. Black eyeliner that I used for my winged eyeliner is the Kat Von D um, ink eyeliner in Trooper and the white that I'm putting under it is the NYX white liquid liner. And the lashes that I'm using are by Ardell Glamour the Wispies Black. I prime my face using the Benefit Professional and the Smashbox Primer Water. For my face, I'm using the e.l.f. BB Cream with SPF 20 in the shade Buff. And I'm using the Real Techniques Buffing Brush just to tap the product into my skin and then buffing it out. two concealers. I'm using the e.l.f. Concealer in Light and the Master Conceal by Maybelline in the shade Light. I'm using the e.l.f. one just um, to like kind of add more coverage on my blemishes and then I'm using the uh, Master Conceal under my eyes and on my forehead, on the bridge of my nose and on the sides of my jaw just to add um, more highlight. And I'm using the Morphe Brushes G1 brush to tap the concealer in. Now 
Now I'm using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder just to set my concealer. This is the face that I have when I'm baking. <laughs> The sponge that I'm using to bake is the Real Techniques Miracle Sponge. I'm using my Sigma F25 Taper Face Brush just to set the rest of my face. I'm just using as little part as I can, whatever's in the cap of the Laura Mercier container. I'm just putting it all over my face. I'm using the e.l.f. contour palette and I'm going to be taking the bottom left shade to bronze my face using the e.l.f. powder brush. In that same palette, I'm going to be taking the bottom right shade to contour using the e.l.f. contouring brush. I'm just blending that contour with the Real Techniques contour brush. Now to contour my lower lip and um, my nose, I'm using the same shade that I used to contour with the e.l.f. contour brush. To blend my contour, I'm using the Sigma E35 Tapered Blending Brush. I'm using the e.l.f. Um, blush palette. I'm using the top right mauve color for my blush with the Sigma F10 blush brush. For my highlight, I'm using the Marc Jacobs Glow Stick in Spotlight. What I'm doing is I'm taking my Bleed Blender and putting it into the product and then putting it on the um, high points of my cheeks, on top of my brow, on the bridge of my nose, and on my Cupid's bow. And look at that highlight. Look at it. Look at it. Blending everything out with my Sigma F15 brush. Going back into the Wet n Wild eyeshadow, I'm taking the blue one and I'm going to take my Sigma E15 flat definer and put it over my lower lash line. I'm blending it all out using my Sigma E30 pencil brush with a little bit of the orange shadow. I'm lining my waterline with the Wet n Wild Coal Eyeliner in Calling Your Bluff. And as mascara, I'm using the e.l.f. Um, mascara primer with the Benefit Their Real Mascara. For my lips, I'm, I'm using the NYX Lingerie in um, the shades 02 and 03, which is embellishment and lace detail. What I did is I put lace detail first on my lips, and then I added just a little bit of embellishment to the center, and then I just blended it all out with a lip pencil brush. Lastly, I'm just setting it all with the makeup setting spray. And this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to check out Makeup by DD's video. I'll be sure to link it down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!